Justin? That is correct, Gord. Summertime and the gas is expensive. And if you have not been to the pump yet, prepare to be hosed. Well, it seems like they know what they're doing and they know when people need the gas. So, supply and demand. I would have rather they left them steady at a certain spot, but you know that they're going to go up anyways during a long weekend and everybody wants to cash in, so <laughs> they're going to do it anyways. Oh no, it's annoying me because it's, uh, you know, every week it's more expensive, you know, so I don't know what, where the limit is. Here comes another long weekend in Ontario. Up go the gas prices. Some people say it's because there isn't enough competition. We found out a way to explain this, though, in a way that might be easier for you to understand, like this. Long weekend, gas prices going down, going up, long weekend, going down, going up, long weekend. Okay, see how that works? If you don't want to buy that explanation, uh, cue the oil company guy. That the market in Toronto area is so competitive and prices do go down in small increments granted, but over a two to three week period, they drop, for example, from 55 cents a liter to 50 cents a liter. That is an indication of strong competition. And that situation is probably going to continue just like this, and at least until the competition laws are changed. Don't hold your breath, or until they come up with a car that runs on something that runs other than gasoline. Don't hold your breath there either. However, you don't have to take this suffering silently. If you don't like this, you can complain. Call Gas Busters. Their telephone number, toll free, 800-268-1142. That's it from Queen Street. Now back into the newsroom.